Having played a lot of his junior football at a prestigious Melbourne private school, he finally found his way to Punt Road to join older brother Duncan in 1997. Went to um, Sandringham, the VFL, VFA, and then um, went on the sup list from there, then got drafted off the sup list, so that's another highlight, I'd say, yeah, just being able to play with brother. He had a few injuries towards the end, playing any game with the siblings, pretty good fun. Always looking out for each other, I guess. A senior debut under Danny Frawley the following year saw Kellaway quickly establish himself as a crucial cog in the Richmond backline. Beautiful mark by Kellaway, just had to sit beautifully. Towards Lloyd Russell and back, that's a courageous mark taken by Andy Kellaway. And that impressive form down back was duly rewarded in 2000, with the Tigers' best and fairest, all Australian honours, and a trip to Ireland for the international rules. What can he make of this? Oh, oh great goalkeeping! What a save goal by Galloway! It was a certain six-pointer. You can test some games and get a bit of confidence up, and the team's playing well. It sort of, I guess that helps. And um, I guess the, the other guys around you, down in defence, wherever it is, if they're playing well and everyone sort of gels together, it, it definitely helps. And you seem to get on a bit of a roll. And he played a big part in the lowly Tigers' upset win over top of the table Adelaide in 2006. Terry Wallace had an idea that um, Adelaide had been playing so well. It was just an idea of maintaining possession. I think you see it a bit now and then now, but not as uh, extreme as that. But uh, it was a good day for the guys in the back line anyway. I think I might have got some boats that day, so yeah, 